Hi folks, Roger Cormier, Midwest Outdoors. We are fishing up in far northern Minnesota, basically the northern limits of where you can go in Minnesota to chase walleyes, pike, smallmouth bass. We got something big on here to start us out. Either a big northern or a big walleye. Joined by Judd Sturm, who with his wife Michelle own Ashkenam Resort in the Ash River. Oh man, oh wow, it's a pike that's got a walleye. That's a good, oh, oh there goes no. the pike. That is cool. I mean like about a 36 inch northern oh, and a 17 yeah. inch walleye. Well, good thing he's going in the fish fry tonight. Look at that and the jig popped right out. Almost hooped him, that was pretty cool. This is Dominic Rice, our guide today. He's putting us on these fish here on Lake Captoga. That should be an awesome day if it's gonna start out like that, boys. Put this one in the box for later, huh? Absolutely, it's like half full eight already. Looks like that's what we got, another big pike. That's fun on white gear, man. I'm telling you what, look at that. This is a seven foot medium heavy power. Another nice northern. See, these guys are up shallow. We got high water this year. And they're up here busting on minnows and eating small walleyes and saugers. And oh man, another tank northern, man. Look at that. Beautiful fish. Love catching these. <laughs> you know, you mentioned uh, Voyagers. We are a water based national park. 218,000 acres. Man, that fish is just taking you right now. He's got some girth to him. He's got some uh, fat on him. We're based off of four main main bodies of water. We got Cabotogama, Rainy, Namakin, and Sandpoint. Lots of camping in the national park. Uh, hiking trails, interior lakes. Uh, lots of great resorts up here. And lots that of nice fish. fish. Lots of nice fish. <laughs> Look at that. Man, this guy's got a big head on him. There's that Halloween shadow wrap shad deep, great jerk bait. And another, you know, 15 pound Beautiful northern. Fish. Absolutely awesome. Well, absolutely awesome fishing up here. You know, yesterday afternoon, it was a blustery kind of rainy afternoon. We weren't really filming, but Judd and his cousin Luke and I went out for a few hours, had some tremendous walleye fishing, caught some real dandy fish on some of the shallow reefs close to shore. And this, you know, such a spectacular backdrop to go fishing in. The western edge of the boundary waters, the Minnesota Canada boundary waters, but no motor restrictions here. You can bring your high horsepower outboards up here, pontoons. Ashkenam Resort, of course, of course, has boat rentals available, canoes. If you want to come up here and explore this entire water-based park by boat, you can do that at your leisure. And, of course, enjoy the great fishing that this area offers. Nice fish. Either that or I got a, a stick. Oh, let's fish. God, is he ever dead weight in that current. Maybe it's a northern on top of the walleye again. That's how we started it out, right? We hit a couple windy points along the way, but it's a pretty blustery day, so we tucked into this back bay with a beautiful waterfall coming out. Just started fishing. I think I got a, another pike here like that one that we started with. A lot of current coming in here, and this water is about four degrees warmer than the main basin right now. So in the spring of the year, you can find that warmer water, and anytime you're around current, you're going to find predators. Real beautiful northern. Yeah, that was fun. That's fun on a walleye rod, guys. Wow. God, he's barely hooked, too. Look at that. Storm Largo shad, little perch pattern. Man, that's about a, about a 15, 16 pound pike right there. What an absolutely awesome fish out of the waterfall. So cool. Make sure she's ready to go. Oh, jeez. Woo! What an awesome fish. Well, Judd, you've got a spectacular piece of property here on the Ash River. Well, thank you. Ash Canam Resort is positioned right in the Ash River. When you take the Ash River out onto the lake, that'll bring you into the Lake Namakin and uh, Cabotogama. Several different sized cabins or whatever, depending on your size of your group. We got up to a five bedroom cabin, or you can just get a nice little uh, two bedroom cabin. Hotel rooms, seasonal RV sites. We have a fish mortuary set up for cleaning your uh, fish after a day. Got the bar and restaurant open seven days a week. You can bring your own fish in and have a fish fry there at the restaurant. Ashkenam is a good family uh, destination for your fishing or 
a relaxation trip. Slow and steady, just keep actually keeping it off the bottom. Picking up most of our walleyes today on the bottom, but this one, it was, I mean, I was just kind of slow reeling that, and gosh, it probably wasn't down three feet. Nice walleye. Chunky, beautiful fish. Oh, look at that, the Largo popped, popped right out. Oh, this is fun, man. We've had an awesome day today, boys. It's been a great day. Beautiful Captogama walleye there. If you'd like to experience spectacular Voyagers National Park, this beautiful scenery, great fishing, you can go to Ashkenam Resort's website for more information or give them a call at the number on your screen. I'd like to thank Judd and Michelle Sturm for putting this up. And of course, our guy, Dominic Rice. If you'd like a guide up in this area, he's the guy to call. I'm Roger Cormier. We'll be right back with more Midwest Outdoors.